So, Josh, Oops. explain some doorways that you find interesting. Um, so the B Bermuda Triangle. Ooh, fuck, dog. Ooh. That's a great one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That is fucking good. Um, even so Christopher Columbus even like talked about some strange occurrences while he, while he, uh, was sailing through it. So like it, it goes back really, really far. And, um, I think in a span of like, I think it was like 10 years that like a hundred vessels, like planes and, and ships just went missing. And, you know, it could just be they sunk or whatever, but like, there's all kinds of stories behind them just completely disappearing, like from the face of the planet. And um, so, like, on the opposite side of the yeah. planet, uh, it, like, I guess in the Sea of, sea of China, I think it's called the, uh, the, the Golden Triangle or something like that. Uh, and it basically, it's on the exact opposite side. The same kind of occurrences happen, almost like it's a doorway through the planet, which is, not, <laughs> which is nuts. So, like, um, yeah, that's kind of what I wanted to see what you guys think. I've think definitely heard of that, and I do believe it is called the Golden Triangle, and that's just tight. Do you, like... It, Isn't the Golden Triangle, like, the fucking opium? Yeah, shit? I think that's... I think it's called, it's called like, the Crystal Triangle or so, yeah. something on the opposite side. So, Bermuda, and then exactly on the opposite side of the planet, there's a, the same uh, mass At, of like, land. the same points. And it's basically like a hole that goes through the planet, which is freaking nuts. Yeah, that's crazy. What do you What do you think it is? What do you think is happening? I think they slip into different dimensions. Personally, yeah. like I think that like it, there's probably like a a disposal um, dimension with all of our ships just like laying there, right. you know, like ship planes. It's like a like, trash land. Right. Yeah, it's, it's like, like, a, it's like the land of the lost. Have you guys yeah, ever seen that? Say, have you yeah. Seen, have you seen? Awesome. Yeah. Okay, so what do you guys think about the Malaysia flight? Did we ever figure out what happened? Yeah, he, he was the, one of the pilots was suicidal. They found <laughs> out, they, they figured it out, and he had the whole thing planned ahead of time. He knew where all the radar pings were, and he flew his plane between the fucking radar pings and then just fucking took it down. No way, so we know what happened. Yep, we know what happened. Oh, dude, wh where'd you hear that? Like I, I don't never... remember. It was like I just read about it like maybe two weeks ago. It was just That's crazy. All right. Yeah. All right. Hold on. I gotta go get back to this because I have questions. All right. So about because I've also heard that and not just like the gold. What is it? The Bermuda Triangle. But we're a little. Oh, well, first off, the Bermuda <laughs> Triangle. I think we all very well have knowledge about like Atlantis and the Bermuda Triangle and the theories that circulate there. But what scientifically could possibly that be? Because there's also like triangles in like California and Alaska area. There's supposed to be set a triangle there. And I think another one too. So like mm -hmm. what what could like really be causing that? What if it's like a thin barrier of reality where things can just slip through, you know? Uh -huh. Caused by what? Is it is it just like is it just a meeting point just based off of the axis or like yeah, maybe away from micro these. black holes right you know, I mean seriously maybe right. not but like it's like we were talking at the beginning of the podcast like different dimensions you know and like mm. that's definitely like a fifth fifth sixth dimensional like control thing you know right. where you you've just removed this object from a point in space but you've also fucking put them into a parallel world you know. <laughs> Yep. Yeah. And that's what I like to lean on. Like, I do kind of think that Bermuda was like the original place where Atlantis kind of sat. And I think something happened there where Atlantis like disappeared and created like this, like, like this event. Mm -hmm. So do you think like Atlanta just, or Atlantis just got sucked up and I, I think that gone, Atlantis, or? I think Atlantis existed on a different plane of reality. And okay. that's why we, I mean, there's right. Plato wrote about it, but like there's record of Atlantis, but like, there's no sign of it. There's no actual tangible. Proof yeah. I was going to ask, but, like, how does that translate in the history and why do we know about it? Like suppose, supposedly it like in mythology, me like, and Rob what, talk about this all the time. <laughs> what Josh was talking about with Plato, like Homer's Odyssey and all that shit. Like Atlantis, like the way the story goes was destroyed by the gods. And like, they had, 
technology like beyond everyone's wildest dreams but like what you were saying kyle like i think that destroyed by the gods thing if in fact atlantis did exist i think that was the only way people could explain why the fuck it disappeared and when yeah. it very well could have just blipped out of reality you know yeah or like, just, like disappeared. our reality yeah so like i think that the remnants of it like the, the like I think it existed. If there's a parallel world or a higher dimension, I think it existed on this said dimension. And whatever happened to it caused such a like an imbalance of energies that like it's felt in our dimension, and that's how like you know where Bermuda is, and maybe right. they just you know something like that. Well, you know, like and, yeah. Wait, what? Oh, what I was gonna say is like um, I think what Josh was saying. I, I I couldn't really hear him that well, but like maybe um, Atlantis just kind of blipped out of reality and caused this huge fucking mm -hmm. thing, you know? Like where, well, what I believe, it's just or, or off, it could, you know? Or like we just revisit like the whole sixth, seventh dimensional thing where maybe it actually exists there still. It's mm -hmm. just not where we can see it. Yeah, yeah exactly. exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. There's the doggy. <laughs> doggy! <laughs> <laughs> let's see the dog josh look yeah we got to see the fat. oh look at that boy oh he's a good boy look um <laughs> so all right i think maybe we'll just end it there for the day um hey, i appreciate you guys showing up thank you guys yeah let's see your knuckles fun. they look great oh, yeah they look yeah they're awesome. doing awesome they're doing really good it, oh, yeah. The computer is censoring your shit. I it's know, like, huh? It doesn't like it. <laughs> yeah, it's but... like no wishes here, no wishes. <laughs> yeah, not right now. Not through my doorway. <laughs> um, cool. Well, we appreciate you guys all listening in. Tune in next week. I don't know what the topic is yet, but that's fine. We'll usually figure it out as we go. Um, so tune in to episode eight of ten. It will be good, and hopefully, I'll have a capture card. Just like and subscribe. Follow us through the <laughs> week. Press that button. Yeah. All right. Bye. Bye. Yeah.